Welcome to a video from thedigitallife.com and when I recorded my uh, Windows 10 build 10565 video I didn't get a chance to show the new Skype messaging functions off because I was having audio problems well I fixed the audio problems with the with this build um, which involved installing a new driver so now I can show those off so I just wanted to do a very quick video showing that off so I've got a Skype machine set up over here so I can test that so like I said on the other video, messaging works very simply. You can send messages between devices and um, they just show up as normal. What I did find as well is the messaging works fine. I've just seen that message come through on my other device. But when you receive messages, let's uh, type a message in on this one, send that over. They don't like that. They don't work in Notification Center. Now, I know we were opening the app, but even if the app was closed, they don't show up. So I think that's work to be done. But what does work is notifications for audio and video calls. So what I'm going to do, I'll go back to the desktop, and I'm going to call this with an audio call. And we'll see if that works. You do get the notification count on there. So there's the call coming in now. So let's answer that with audio. And now that's doing an audio call, and we can hear the echo. And that's just an audio call. So that was an audio call. Let's try a video call. There we go. Let's answer that with video. And there we go. We got the, the video call. We can get a bit of feedback. I'll turn that down. So there we are. We've got a video call coming in. And can we go to something else? It looks like... We can. Ah, there you go. There's that problem with it. Uh, when you minimise, it uh, stops. Let's go back to it now and see if it carries on. Yeah, there it goes. So you can see it works, and it just that it stops when we go to minimise. I guess can we have a message at the same time? It looks like we can. If I send a message. just seen that going across on the other device so that's working so there we go we've got a Skype call running a Skype video call running and I can send disable my video or and just go audio or whatever so I've got those three apps and there's a little preview of the, the video so one other thing just to look at is the UI about making a call so let's go back to the Skype app okay so let's Call that person. It'll be my test phone. And I've just answered the call on there. And that seems to be working okay. Although the video's not come through yet. Let's have a quick look at the UI. So here you can see the history of calls we've made. You've got a speed dial and you can add to the speed dial on there through one of your contacts. So I could add a test account there. Let's add the Skype account. So that's a quick way of adding in. Or you can go through the people app and just choose the people from, from that list. And that's it really. There's no other settings. There's no audio settings or anything like everything is taken from Windows. Same for the video setup. There's no there's no setup or anything like that. You can just take it's just there's just the app. I mean there's just literally that's it. There's just the basic app. Same for video, there's no setup. There's although there are settings setup that's for setting up SMS. There's only a couple of settings on there and there's no audio or video setup, everything's done through Windows and that and you get a list of your calls and you can add people you want to add a contact to. So this is the modern interface, it replaces the old Skype interface which you uh, test on here, which you know, is getting a bit long in the tooth and a bit cluttered so this is a much better system having the modern apps and um, there's still work to do to get them all more refined and sort of notifications and everything else but the, some of the, the call notifications were coming in before just not the the text notifications so that's the new messaging apps on Windows 10 build 10.5.6.5 I'm sure they'll improve on future builds more videos on our YouTube channel and on the digitallifestyle.com